Yes, that's right. Now you can become Batman. Hello YouTube, welcome back to another video. In this one we're talking about the new Caning Cape and Glider combo. As always, it's kind of, it's just a cape and a glider you think. However, in this case, the cape actually expands into becoming a glider, kind of like how Batman glides down in Gotham when he expands his cape. It's, it's a shame that the arms don't expand, I'm not gonna lie. But, um, copyright issues, I suppose, are in it. Anyway, getting back to it. It's 700 gems, which I think is a steal for this because it is really, really nice and really cool. And it has four die patterns. But we'll get into that in a bit. So, first off, when I look at capes, how long is it? So, as you can see, we're on the hero panel and the wardrobe section and I've typed in capes. Now, when it comes to capes, I'm actually really, really picky. I like long capes. I'm not going to deny it. Let me just hide my scarf quickly. I like long capes. These short capes, they just don't do it for me. I mean, I suppose the shimmering ore one is okay because it is long in a sense, but it just doesn't have the same effect. So far, the longest capes have been the Wandering Weapons Master Cape and also the two Frost Capes. So the Frost Archer Cape and the Frost Scout Cape, both of, reach, both of which reach really low down to the bottom of your character. However, the new Canine Cake Cake, sorry, the new canine cape reaches pretty much the same length on the two edges at the side, but it's got this open bit just here, which is not too bad. So its length is actually really, really good, and it covers a fair amount of your back bit just there. Um, so it's not all that bad. In terms of the die section, as I said earlier, you got four dies, so it's pretty simple. You can change the color if you want to. So, as you can tell, I'm a huge orange fan here, so if I change... Ooh, that actually looks pretty nice just there. That to orange, and then on the glider section, you can also change it, and then swap back and forth between the two. Ooh, that's actually really nice. Let's have a look. Ooh, yeah, I like that. That's actually really, really nice. Okay, so let's switch to a different uh, scene and we'll see what it looks like when you're walking around. Okay, so here we are in Divinity's Reach. Let me just hide my UI quickly and we'll go walk mode and we'll have a look. So yeah, I mean, it's pretty reminiscent of a normal walking style. So nothing bad there. The capes are done really well in Guild Wars 2. I'm not gonna let deny it. The way they move around, it's really nice. Mm, not a huge amount of clipping, which is pretty nice. So, but yeah, this is how it looks on a Silvari. So let's have a switch over to the next character. Okay, so next up is human female meta. Okay, let's go with Char. Now, I've got to give Arena Net props here. Capes are really, well, any sort of back item is really hard to do on a Char. And they've actually nailed it on this. It looks really good. I mean, they're still clipping with the tail. You're always going to get that. But I think it actually works really, really nicely. And look at this run animation just here. It's barely even clipping. I mean, my warhorn is, but that's because my warhorn's so big. But it just looks so nice on a char. 
I've got to give him credit for this one. Uh, let's have a look at the glide. He is Batcha. Not quite as good as the human or the Silvari, but it is still very nice. I, I, I like this a lot. This is a good purchase, especially with a char. Now I have quite a few char characters. I am putting this on all my char characters. All right, let's move on. Okay, next up is Norn. Um, first thing to note, great sword clips. It always happens. There's nothing you can do about it. So let's swap that out. Um, again, looks very nice. Reaches pretty much all the way to the bottom. Actually works really well with the Norn Tier 3 Cultural Armor, which has got kind of a mini cape in itself at the bottom because I don't have the legendary leggings yet. But yeah. No clipping on, well there's clipping on that animation, but normal attack animation, no. Very nice, let's have a look at the glide. Let's go bat norn. Ooh, actually looks, that looks all right just there, you know. I am bad norn. Its opening animation is really nice as well. Shame it doesn't have a closing animation, but the opening animation is really nice. Okay, last up is Azura. So, Azura. Um not gonna lie. Well, I don't know. I can't decide. I think it could be a little bit longer, but if you have it even longer, it's just going to clip into the ground. So it's questionable, but I don't think it looks as good on Azura. But then again, capes on Azuras are generally super hard to see unless you're zoomed all the way in like most outfits. So it's difficult to tell. I think it's just a bit too small on the Azura. I think the cape, the glider could be a little bit bigger. But yeah, I mean, that's just my opinion. You, leave your opinion in the comment section below of what you think it looks best on. But so far, my favorite is by far the char. So in conclusion, I think ArenaNet did really well on this. I really love this cape. It is a supremely cool cape. It looks really good on Char, which I've got to give them props for because of how hard it is, like I said before. Um, it looks badass gliding. I love the opening action. I wish they'd have made some sort of closing action, but no glider has that, so you can't expect much. Um, I wish they'd thrown the hands up in the air like Batman, but again, um, copyright suing issues so i'm not surprised they didn't manage that but it is a supremely cool cape well worth the 700 gems in my opinion um leave your opinions in the comment section below whether you think it's worth it whether you um are going to get it what character or what race you think it looks best on um as a final note i'm gonna give one away so as always, IGN in the comment section below for your chance at winning and in a week's time. So that would be Wednesday the 13th. I will draw a winner and give them a free cape and glider combo to make them look like Batman or Bat-Char if you're going to be a Char. Um, 
Quick disclaimer, if we're in it, remove it from the gem store. I have no control over being able to send it to you. But that's it for this one, chat. So comment section below and let me know what you think.